my name is Briggs. I'm a student at Mountain High, and we are here today at the STEM Expo. When I first walked in the Expo Hall, I thought it was interesting how they had the drones like positioned right there. People are intrigued by them, so I thought that was cool how they had that right there. You know, they had some cool cars and different opportunities and things you could do or things you might be interested in that you might not have considered before. I was really looking forward to like construction companies ahead of my career. The construction places that I feel like getting more information into is Hogan Construction. My first panel, it had them in it and I was really shook about how their company really works. And I'm kind of excited to get into that kind of company. One of the things that really piqued my interest out of everything that I saw was the Hughes Construction booth. They have internships starting whenever and you can get, it's a paid internship. They'll pay you and they'll train you and they'll give you tools and stuff and I thought that was really cool so my plan is to now go and just look more into that when I get home so I'm pretty excited about that. Typically what we try to do at the Expo is have a wide variety, things like advanced manufacturing, computer science, digital media and design, architecture, construction, transportation, you know, all these different areas. One of the things that we haven't had in the past that's kind of different this year is we have a lot of automotive companies here. Being an auto mechanic is not what you think of in, as being in the past, you know, with wrenches and things. Very high tech and technical and they're here kind of promoting that. So this event is a partnership across four school districts, so Davis, Morgan, Weber, and Ogden school districts. Well, the whole point of this event really is for them to potentially stop focusing too much on careers and talk to people who are out there solving problems, who are making discoveries, who are coming up with new technologies. So if they leave thinking about problems they could solve, then we've kind of won the day.